What is up everybody? Welcome back to the Phase Reviews YouTube channel. My name is Jordan, AKA DJ Phase, and today I'm gonna to be taking a look at my personal DJ headphones of choice, the Vmoda Crossfade LP2. Before we get started, I would love if you would subscribe to this new YouTube channel. I've got a lot of great reviews coming your way in the next few weeks and months as well as heading on over to my Instagram at DJ Faze, F-A-Y-Z-E, because there's a lot of good content coming out over there. But without any further ado, let's take a look at these headphones. All right, so I wanted to talk about the packaging before I got into the product. Again, this isn't an unboxing, and I don't even have the packaging anymore because I've been using these headphones for about a year and a half. But suffice it to say, Vmoda did an excellent job in sending it in a very attractive, hard case with a leather buckle on the top, it looked fantastic. It was only indicative of the quality that you're gonna see once you get inside the packaging. All right, so when you open up the packaging, you're gonna pull out this. This is the case the headphones come in. It's a fantastic case. It's zippered around the edge. It's a nice, hard, like a foam material. It's gonna take up less space than if these were just in a box, but it's also gonna protect your headphones way better than if they were just in like a bag or some sort of silk carrying case. I love that about it. You're gonna see the Vmoda logo embroidered right here, and they've also got a little carabiner if you wanted to hook them onto the inside of your backpack or the outside. So before we look at the headphones, let's look at what else comes in the package. Up on this side of the case here, you're gonna notice that on each side are some elastic straps that hold in cables. A nice feature, nothing's flopping around in the case. This cable right here, I actually haven't even utilized, but this cable has a microphone on it along with some volume buttons. If you wanted to use these headphones more personally than work instead of DJing and you wanna have them out and about and talk on your phone, this is a great cable to have. On this side, I'm gonna actually just set this down. On this side, you've got the cable that I use the most, which is just your standard um, 3.5 millimeter audio cable. This end plugs into your headphones, so it's nice that this is detachable. If you ever had to replace the cable to your headphones, you don't have to replace the entire setup. You can just order a cable. On this side, you have a 45 degree angle with an adapter for quarter inch, which is what I use with my mixer. Now. Let's talk about these cables for a second. This cable is supposedly woven with Kevlar and they guarantee it for 1 million bends, okay? Not that you're gonna be counting, right? But a million bends guaranteed, this is probably gonna be indestructible. I've had zero problems with the uh, cable so far and it's been used at a lot of events. The 45 degree angle connector is a nice bonus. This means if it's plugged into your mixer, you're not gonna pull it straight out or you're not gonna be yanking it you know, at a 90 degree angle to the plug. It's at a nice ergonomic angle that'll probably keep it from shorting out in the long run. Also inside of the case, you're gonna see a cloth. This is because the outside of your headphones are shiny. They can get fingerprints, they can get scratched up and nasty. You can clean them off with this. You'll notice I haven't unwrapped it. I'm a working DJ, I don't have time to clean my headphones, but it's there if you need it. All right, now let's take a look at the headphones themselves. The first thing I wanna talk about is their durability. The construction on these is phenomenal. That was my biggest problem with my other DJ headphones. They were flimsy, they were plastic, they broke way too easily and cracked. These are built like tanks. So you've got this metal bracket connecting your ear cups to the band, uh, really, really durable. Up top, you've got a nice padded strap with the Vmoda logo very faintly across the top. Uh, this is a really nice mesh fabric here. It's padded, not that this part matters too much about being padded, but it's nice to know that it is. The ear cups, are very, very, very plush, okay? These are like pillows for your ears. Um, no complaints. They even sell upgraded ear cups. I see no need to do that. I've never, after doing an eight hour wedding, had ear fatigue from these ear cups. They feel phenomenal. Uh, you'll see more of that Kevlar wire connecting the ear cup to the headband. So once again, not skimping out, even though this is a part that's not gonna be yanked and, and bent too much, they still put nice quality parts on that. Now let's talk about the sound quality. Another plus, if you're buying these to DJ with especially, or anyone, if you're buying headphones, you want them to sound good, right? These do not disappoint. They've got 50 millimeter drivers in there, and Vmoda claims that the frequency response is five hertz to 30,000 hertz, which is much more than your typical 20 to 20,000, which you have with most headphones. Whether they actually achieve that or not, I haven't tested, but I do know that they sound phenomenal, especially the low end. Now, I'm an audiophile. At home, I love to listen to a very well-balanced sound system, but when I'm DJing, you need to hear your low end so that you can beat match and mix your tracks correctly. 
So these help with that a ton. Other headphones that I tested were weak or blah in the low end, these punch, okay? You're gonna hear the beats of your music and you're gonna be able to mix much better. Well, that's gonna depend on your DJ skill. These are definitely not gonna be a detriment though. Now, the last thing I wanted to talk about are these shields. Now, one of Vmoda's claims to fame with these headphones is they're customizable. These don't come with this gold like this. They come with a plain black and I think an optional silver inside of the box. But for about $30, and up, you can go to Vmoda's website and customize your own shields. Now, I chose to put my DJ name, DJ Phase, and I also have some kind of decorative, uh, like olive branches going up around it. You can put a few different designs, you can upload your logo, your company name, whatever you wanna do. The metals that this comes in come in a bunch of different colors, as well as textures and materials. So really the sky's the limit as far as customization. I think the gold adds a nice pop and branding is everything. So this really helps these headphones stick out. Someone sees these like, oh wow, you've got your name on your headphones. It really does uh, make a difference. So overall impressions, I love these headphones. I've tried a few different brands, a few different models. Nothing really stood out to me until I got these and these are absolute workhorses. A um, hundred gigs later, a year and a half later, they're still going strong barely any scratches, barely any damage. You, you wouldn't know that these had been through so much. They're phenomenal headphones. I can recommend them 100%. So there you have it, the Vmoda Crossfade LP2, my personal DJ headphones of choice that I cannot recommend enough. If you wanna grab yourself a pair, head on over to Amazon. The link is down in my description. Purchasing through that link will help me fund this channel and make more great content for all of you. I appreciate you watching and I hope that I've earned your subscription. If I have, go ahead and subscribe down below. So now I wanna ask you, what's your favorite set of headphones? Whether it's personal or business use, let me know what your favorite pair is down in the comments. And until next time, thanks for watching.